we wanted to send out some videos to help you all get your games ready for the spring and summer. It's been great seeing some of you out on the driving range and over at the golf park. We just want to continue to help you get ready for this golf season that's coming up hopefully very soon. As you're doing these drills and these practice things that we give you, make sure you keep your six foot distance still from the person closest to you or any walls or mirrors or TVs. We don't want anything broken or anybody to get, um, to get hurt as you do these. So the first thing I want to talk about this spring is balance. Most of these videos we're going to give you, you can find things at home that are going to help you to do these drills. All you need today is a towel and a chair or a bar stool. You can even use, a, you can even use the wall. If you use the wall, I recommend no golf club as you do these drills. So as we're talking about balance, first you can just stand up nice and straight. Center your feet on the towel so that you can feel it right under your arches. I just want you to rock back and forth from your toes to your heels. And as you do that, you can kind of feel how you get on those toes, then the heels, and then kind of stop so you feel that pressure right under your arch there. Now we need to get in good golf posture with this balance. As you're getting in the golf posture, you're going to tilt over and also start to stick that tailbone out. So as I'm getting this golf posture, I still keep that same balance on my feet. I don't feel myself bending over, getting in my toes. I don't want to be too far back on my heels where my toes are way off the ground. So now in the golf posture, rock back and forth a little bit, find that balance, and now you're set. After you've gotten set like that, I want you to take the chair or back yourself up to the wall and just put that right against your tailbone there because we're going to try and keep this same posture and balance as we make the swing. So as you start your back swing, I want you to feel that weight go a little more into your back heel and notice how I keep my tailbone or my backside right against that chair still. I don't want to start to stand up out of my posture, my weight goes to my toe, or if I stay in my posture but my weight goes to my toe, I move away from that chair, my head goes forward, both bad positions to be in. So now, make a good backswing, I'm still in that posture, I feel balanced on my trail foot, I'm still touching the chair. As I start to swing down, I feel my weight shift forward, but then I want to feel the weight go into my lead heel. So I can feel that pressure there. You can see my tailbone or my backside is still up against the chair. Too often we see people start to swing down, they get on their toes, they stand up, they get out of posture, and it makes it really hard to hit good golf shots from there. We see top shots, we see the club get really outside. So the big things I want you to take away from this are your starting posture balance, your balance on those feet, Weight kind of centered over the arches, maybe a little towards the heels. Back swing into the left heel, or your trail heel, my left heel, your trail heel. Then you just swing down, shift to the front foot, into that lead heel, keep that posture, and finish. One last thing you can look for when you make the full finish is to see if you can get the toes up in the air. The weight's towards the heel, toes are up in the air slightly. When you watch any great golfer, you're going to see that finish with those toes slightly in the air. Hope you guys get some good practice in. Hope to see you guys soon out on the driving range and golf park.